Hey everyone, hey my dear brother Christ. Today is another day closer to redemption. No one is guaranteed tomorrow. No one knows when they'll take their last breath or when the rapture will happen. Brothers and sisters, everyone else, thank you for being here in the truth community. It's very comforting to have brothers and sisters that know Jesus Christ is real. None of us are perfect, but Christians are trying to tell people the important truth about the world and about salvation. Salvation is only found through Jesus Christ. Fully man, fully God. He was born in a manger. He lived a perfect sinless life. And then he died on the cross so we can live. He shed his precious blood, was buried, then resurrected three days later according to the scriptures. Please believe in Jesus Christ and his finished work on the cross. Let's look at three different actors from different parts of the world. Jack O'Connell is an actor. He's on a magazine cover. We know who gets on magazine covers, right? The people that do one-eye symbolism and hide their hand in their coat the way a Freemason would do. And he does the Uttara Bodhi Mudra with his hands there, a gesture that's supposed to represent supreme enlightenment. It is not. It's the false light of Lucifer, who is Satan, and it's also the pride of humanity to pose like this. Natawin Watanana Gittafat? I'm not, that's a hard name to pronounce, come on. But he's another actor, and he's doing a one-eye symbolism as well. Why is he doing that? Is this all a coincidence? No, it's because the world is sold out in biblical bad news about the world. The good news is the gospel of Jesus Christ. He's successful in this world, so he's got the sign of success on his hand. I don't know if he's a homosexual himself, but he's portraying one in a movie here. And the world will do that nowadays, right? It's very trendy. They want to push this agenda on us. Homosexuality, pride of sin, and they want to push the transgender agenda as well. And wouldn't you know, he's wearing a NASA shirt, right? NASA is definitely super, super legit. NASA in Hebrew means to deceive and beguile. NASA means to deceive. Javier Rey is another actor. I'm not sure where he's from, but he's doing one-eye symbolism here. Very clearly darkening one eye, covering half his face, and doing the eye of Horus. And he's doing it again here. Is this a coincidence? If you're a photographer, would you, wouldn't you want to see his whole face to put it on a magazine cover or whatever? Nope, you want him to cover his eye. <clears throat> There's still a little bit of a debate about how they do these signs and symbols because some people say, oh, it's the photographers or the directors or whatever. But doing this enough that, like, there may be cases of that. I'm not saying there's never cases of that. But I think a lot of these people, they know exactly what they're doing. Well, not really, but they're in an industry. They're not thinking about salvation, is my point. But they're doing these signs and symbols, and they like to do these signs and symbols. And Javier Ray hides his hand in his coat the way a Freemason would do. And he does the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. That gesture, that funny-sounding name, one day soon, hopefully, I won't have to say Uttara Bodhi Mudra anymore because no one will be doing it. Or if we do, we're doing it you know, by chance and not meaning it to be supreme satanic enlightenment. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, everyone else, God bless you.